Hello, I hope you're in fine voice. Now let's take a look at a really good way to record and edit. And I think this way makes it much simpler and easier to achieve your recording goals. The trick is to keep recording even though you've made a mistake, but reread that line again. And then when you review it in post-production, you can actually see and hear where the mistake has happened. So let me try and give you an example with a script here. It's all about creating a connection with your target audience. It's about delivering Ompok and King Kong through merchandise and oh, made a mistake there. It's about delivering impact and engagement through merchandise that people actually want. OK, so let's listen to where that mistake was and then we can just simply chop it out. It's all about creating a connection with your target audience. So that bit was fine. It's about delivering Ompok and King Kong through merchandise and oh, made a mistake there. So that's the bit that's the error. And then here's where I correct it a little bit further on. It's about delivering impact. And so I know that was the right thing. So I simply remove this bit here. Bring those together, remove that breath. Let's see what happens if I play. It's all about creating a connection with your target audience. It's about delivering impact and engagement through merchandise that people actually want. It's a great habit to get into. What you're doing is you're going into record. Doesn't matter what software you're using. I was using Audacity, but you could be using Adobe Audition or Pro Tools or Logic Pro, Reaper, whatever. But you go into record and then you keep going when you make a mistake. Just go back and reread that line again. And when you review it in post-production, you can hear and see where the mistake is. Chop that out and bring the two pieces together. All right. Thanks very much for watching today. Look after your voice and see you next time. Mm -hmm.